All right, Tom, thank you. Tonight, SoCal Gas announced it's close to stopping the ongoing natural gas leak in Porter Ranch. The timeline to have the leak fixed has been pushed up. CBS 2's Jennifer Kastner is live in Porter Ranch with the update. And Jennifer, the company also says it has reduced the gas emissions, right? That's right, gas emissions down by 60%. Also, the timeline for repairs has changed. Originally, we were told all of these things would be fixed late February to late March. Now, tonight, that has changed. We were, are now being told late February, late February, if not sooner. So a big relief to the people who live and work here in Porter Ranch. I want to get to some of our video right now. SoCal Gas is reporting more than a 60% reduction in emissions since the peak back in November. According to the California Air Resources Board, a major update tonight on the benzene controversy, that cancer-causing chemical. SoCal Gas says the benzene risk levels in Porter Ranch were the same as levels consistent with other parts of the LA Basin, according to the AQMD. One more big update tonight. SoCal Gas will no longer be burning off the methane gas because their engineers say it is simply too dangerous to do so. Now tonight, the Save Porter Ranch group tells us despite all of this seemingly good news, they still have absolutely no faith in SoCal Gas. All their updates have been the official updates. And what has come true? Nothing. Out of safety concern, they should shut down the facility. They can't manage their facility. The regulators cannot manage SoCal Gas, and Jerry Brown cannot manage the regulators. And tonight I spoke with SoCal Gas. They said they have absolutely no plans to shut down the entire facility. Back to you. Okay, Jennifer, thank you for the update. Switching now to weather.